All right, and welcome again to another episode of Mr. Felstrom's Pre-Calc Cast. Today's episode is Benchmark 10.2, the Cosine Angle Addition and Subtraction Formulas. So here I have listed the Cosine uh, Angle Addition and Subtraction. The only thing you need to be careful of with this is if we are adding our angles, we actually subtract the cosine and sine functions. Uh, and if we're subtracting our angles, we're going to add uh, the cosine and sine functions. So here we have uh, to use the angle sum or addition formulas to evaluate the exact uh, answer below. So cosine of 255 degrees. So our task is to, to first identify which two angles we can use. Now since it ends in 5, we know it has to be a 45. And I can either add or subtract 45 to see what I get. Uh, if I add 45 to 255, I get 300. So I can actually rewrite cosine of 225 as the cosine of 300 minus 45. Now the reason why I'm using 300 is that is a, uh, a special angle, reference angle, since uh, the full rotation is 360. This is going to be in quadrant, 300 degrees is going to be in quadrant 4 uh, with a reference angle of 60 degrees. So that's going to be one of my special triangles. So the first thing I'm going to do now is uh, write out my formula. So cosine of 300 times the cosine of 45. And it's going to be plus, since I am subtracting, sine of 300, sine of 45. Now next I'll actually evaluate uh, cosine of 300. And uh, really these evaluatings are just uh, from benchmark 9.1. Cosine 300, reference angle is 60. Again, that is because 300 is in quadrant 4, like I said. And if I make that with the x-axis, this angle right here is 60 degrees. So that, that special triangle is the 30, 60, 90. So I'm actually looking at this. So the cosine of 300 is 1 half. And in quadrant 4, cosine's positive, so I'm actually okay. Cosine of 45, 1 over square root of 2, which is square root 2 over 2. Sine of 300, again, 60 degrees, opposite, hypotenuse, square root 3 over 2. And sine is negative in quadrant 4, so I'm actually going to want negative square root 3 over 2. And the sine of 45 is square root 2 over 2. Okay, multiplying those, square root 2 over 4 plus a negative square root 6 over 4 combines 2, square root 2 minus square root 6 all over 4. And there is our final answer. All right, and he, there you go. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.